Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel, GMike, uh, good source about uh, gaming laptops and mobile GPUs. Today I have a, a video which many people ask me about, uh, how to limit the frames to 60 in your gameplay and how to reduce the temperatures. So you're going to need a uh, uh, MSI afterburner, you're going to uh, go to your uh, monitoring, you're going to set your uh, GPU 1, of course GPU 2 if you got two GPUs, uh, to show on your on-screen display. And you're gonna also make sure your frame rate it's also visible on on-screen display just like this then you are uh, gonna move to the next section you're gonna go to the right bottom corner to Riva tuner and on a general settings here just like that you're gonna move uh, down here uh, third line we got a frame rate limit it's set to zero, it means there is no limit set, your game will uh, go as high as, as possible. But if you press 60 on it and you press enter, your game will be limited to uh, 60 frames, okay? If you want to turn it back again, uh, you can alt up from the game and you're gonna click on zero, click enter and that's it. So the first game of today is gonna be uh, Shadow of Mordor, uh, let's see the temperatures. In the top left corner you can see a GPU 1 and GPU 2 as I'm a supported SLI system using a dual GTX 780M on Alienware 18. Right now we are above uh, 60 frames, we are moving on 75, 76 degrees. Remember uh, more frames uh, you can see in the game uh, how to will be your uh, system. If you have a weaker GPU and you are not going above uh, 60 frames, there is no point to uh, limit those. So basically this uh, tutorial is only for people who have a powerful machines and want to reduce the temperatures a little bit and also have 60 Hz screen. We are above uh, 60 frames, we are temperatures around 75 to 77 degrees. Of course, the uh, longer you will play, uh, your machine will get a little bit hotter. So originally we have 77 degrees. Let's now have a look uh, with a limit set to 60 frames. Of course you can uh, set the limit to lower to 45 and to still have a lower temperatures but right now we have uh, 60 frames and we have stable 70 degrees, look at that. So before the similar gameplay we had 76, 77 right away, right now we are on 70 degrees. We are now a little bit under, but still we have in a kind of stressful uh, situation uh, full of uh, details and frames. We can see 70 degrees, it's stable, it doesn't move higher. Now let's have a look on another game, we have uh, Dreamfall Chapters, a new game from this year, GPU 1, uh, in this scene on ultra settings we have uh, 76 degrees on GPU 1 and around uh, 48 on a uh, GPU 2. The frames are higher, we have uh, 90, 80, 70 jumping up and down, also move to 120 in certain scenes. So right now on GP1 at 76, 77 degrees, it's going slowly higher. In this game I reached in my system 85 degrees, which I was a little bit uh, worried about. I know uh, the system can handle it, but I don't like 85 degrees temperature. Now uh, in the best scene, we are uh, moving on 78 degrees and we are going higher. We're gonna jump slowly to uh, 79 and then to 80. As 
you can see now uh, 79 degrees and 45 on the GPU too. The frames are good, 88. And slowly we reach 80 degrees. I think that's uh, pretty too much uh, for a laptop and if you don't like these temperatures, highly uh, advise that uh, you want to set your limit to a uh, 60 frames I'll tap to your system click 60 frames press enter and go back to your game and let's see the temperatures now so we are moving now on uh, 55 to uh, 60 frames something like that is limited now to 60 does not go higher and you can see the uh, GPU is on 70 degrees 69 70 it's moving up and down but the mostly is going to stay in this level. Now we're going to move to the bed scene and to see the temperatures where they were the highest. We got 69 degrees. I think it might go lower, one degree. But right now we have 69 degrees, and before we had 80 degrees. Guys, that's 11 degrees uh, difference. And I think for your system, it's a pretty good relief. Thanks for watching. Uh, one more time, that was a little tutorial how to limit your frames and reduce your temperatures only if you are above 60 frames. So you have to have a powerful GPU like a GTX 765, 770, 770M, or you go higher 880M. Uh, 870M or the new 9MTM series. Thanks for watching, rate, comment, subscribe, and see you later.